time using this, the Long and Lux, and it smells absolutely fantastic like seriously if you guys have not seen my video on the products i use on my locks i'll definitely link it right here for you to go and check out and you can see how this along with having a good healthy balanced diet of plant-based foods can help with lovely hair growth but i just wanted to come on and say this because this smells really 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 nice if you want to try it definitely check out this link right here because i've got some links in that video or i might as well just put the links down here you will see it if you go down in the description bar below or check this video out right here okay so let me finish washing my hair and as you can see i'm still losing some hair still losing some hair this is crazy doesn't seem like as much as the last time but Ugh, this is crazy. I am losing a lock from postpartum hair loss. Guys, I think I'm about to lose a lock. Look at this. Do you see how thin this is? Look at that. Can you see that? Look at that. I'm about to lose a whole entire lock. I literally just feel like I want to... Oh, yeah. Just cut it off. I'm telling you, man, like, postpartum hair loss is depressing. It is depressing. It's depressing. Um, especially when you see, like, you're losing a whole lock, <laughs> you know? And it's funny because I was looking back at my first video that I uploaded in my postpartum hair loss vlogs, which I will just link above for you to check out. <laughs> And I was looking at that and I'm like, look how much hair I had then. And that was what, May 15th? I was like, all my hair was there. Still. Well, not all of it. It was starting to go, but it was not like what it looks like right now. You know? And then now to see that this lock here is literally about to fall right off. I'm like literally like annoyed. Like really, 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 really annoyed. But I know my hair will grow back because this is not the first time this has happened. But I, I don't think it was to the point where it looked like one of my lock was about to fall out in my last, my previous postpartum hair loss experience. You know, that was with my third son Noah right here. I just don't know what's going on, man. And it's really annoying. Like, I'm going to lose a whole entire lock to postpartum hair loss. But... Anyway, I'm going to stop, like, sitting here feeling all types of upset. I mean, this is the journey. I'm going to talk about how I'm feeling and everything like that. I've been walk, walk, walking around. Look at this. Can you see all of this? Look at this. Look at all my hair is going, guys. Like, look, it's just going.
while the recording of my main video has been interrupted for more than one reason you know children being up and batteries just gone dead on my camera i thought why not um you know just come on here and give you guys a quick update as well as answer this particular question that i literally just got like literally just seen this um seen this um comment on my previous video so i am about to answer it give me a second so while my main recording has been paused um i got a message from not a message but a comment on my last video which i'll link above and um i thought this was a very interesting question and this question a uh, comment slash question came from i'm just waiting for this to load support my channel guys and watch the ads okay that's how us youtubers get paid support the cause if you support me her comment reads great video i agree that juicing and smoothies will give you just as much or even more nutrients than vitamins i'm sure your edges will grow back in no time this is the exact reason why i dislike hearing people talk uh, talk bad about thin edges since they never really know what a person is going through or why it happened. And I agree with that so much. I find that when these things are not happening to a particular person, to whoever is running their mouth saying these things, when they're not experiencing it or never experienced it, they don't understand the emotions that come along with it. They don't understand it. So when people, when I hear people say that or when people talk bad about people who have thin edges or no edges, it just makes me think like, come on now, you don't know what is the cause. Like not everybody who experience hair loss or lose their edges is going through like traction alopecia in terms of, you know, they're pulling their hair too tight. They're not taking care of their hair, etc. That is not always the case. So... Don't go around like, you know, talking bad about people on the edges because some people can have alopecia because there are so many different forms of alopecia. So don't be ignorant to the fact. If you're not sure, go and check it out. And alopecia simply means hair loss, okay? And there's so many different forms of them. Some of them are terminal, etc. You know what I mean? So yeah, I agree with that. Like when people talk bad about people's edges, it's just like, then she asked me a very interesting question. She says, I'm curious, does your locks feel any thicker since there is a lot of shedding from the postpartum hair loss? And as you guys can see in the clip prior to this one, yes, all my shedded hair did go into my lock. And you know, at the, you know, the, the base part of the lock or the, you know, the top part where from the, um, the root to that part, to the locker you notice that it's much thicker but my roots are so thin so yes the shedded hair definitely went into the locks but my edges are still looking thin and my lock roots are so thin that i am literally scared to retwist like obviously i gave my i washed my hair and retwisted it and everything but the ones at the front i barely twisted it barely because i was just so scared that i might just pop my hair off but um after realizing how thin this one particular lock of mine was like what you guys saw on camera was just like me when i'm calmed down and guys i'm telling you check out the video that i'm gonna link above that i probably have already linked it but if not just check the information button here guys when i was checking back at my video and seeing that that was on may 15th and my edges were not like this i'm like look how much hair i've lost in such a short space of time so you know i'm just literally like what the heck like i just can't be bothered whatever you know i'm just like i'm done i can't cope I don't know what would you guys do like obviously I'm gonna ride it out and keep my hair but it's crazy like it's so thin I, I'm just like I just can't believe how thin it is like it literally just feel like my hair is about to pop right off but I don't know so yes guys your hair does actually 
you know, the shed hair does actually go into your lock. And even though it makes the lock look thicker, it does not really make your um, edges look thicker, <laughs> you know. But yeah, I just wanted to answer that question before I signed off this video.